Canada Day. So we're focusing on Canada, how we celebrate it, why it's so amazing, and being able to meet up in Berlin with a bunch of other Canadians. Been on hold for way too long, trying to get my cell phone to work in Germany because I bought a traveling data package when I was in Denmark. But for some reason, the data is not working. And if I don't have my data, I'm going to be extremely lost once I get my bike. So, patiently waiting. All right, this is the new whip for the week. Trusty bell, bunch of gears, got that light action. Mm. She's a beauty. Also got that trusted basket, so I don't have to break my back. Sick. I ended up in this park. So this park's been cool because it already reminds me of Copenhagen. Big, grassy, open area for people to be social. But, I think they like to drink a little bit more here in Germany or Berlin. Because there's like a legit little bar cafe thing in the middle of the park. There's also animals. There's a zoo here. There's like camels and little goats and stuff. Which again, it's raining, I'm sorry. I just don't want to destroy my camera because I love it so much and I've already destroyed it a lot. But I've been able to bike around the park, kind of know where I'm going, finish my audiobook, which feels amazing. And now that it's kind of settled, I'm going to try and make my way to the Canada Day party. So here's the realistic part of traveling solo without any cell phone service or trying to save money. Right now I'm in a hardware store, sitting on one of their display picnic tables. I'm eating some oatmeal kind of stuff because that was like the cheapest thing I could get that I could eat a lot of. As always, I have my water with me. But I'm pretty screwed. I don't really know where I am. I think I know where I need to go. But yeah, just kind of feeling out of place. Isolated, lonely, a little bit homeless. I'm gonna keep eating this, get my Canada Day gear on, and hopefully find out where I gotta go. So you spend some amount of time in your life in the bathroom. So why not make it amazing? Like this one's even holographic. 3D. This one's my favorite though. Just because it's like super chill. But seriously though, why not get excited when you go to the toilet? I think that's a great idea. So I think I found it. There we got Canada being represented. So I'm all set with my hat and I got my flag now. So 
We're gonna go check it out. Are you from Canada? I am. Montreal. Montreal. Nice to meet you. Nice from Ontario. You. you were in there? Yeah. It's, yeah. it's nice. Good. Yeah. yeah. People are nice. So. What are you? Uh, what are you doing now? Are you hanging out? Or are you? I'm gonna go home and then I come back. Are you come back? Yeah. Uh, I need some money and then uh, I I have no money on me and they need uh, money. For me. Oh, okay. Okay. We'll see you later. See you later. Cool. I already met one Canadian. On to meet the rest. It looks pretty bumping though. I'm excited. This is crazy. <laughs> There's like so many people here, this is ridiculous. There's even like a little concert stage over here, so I'm gonna go check that out. And then we'll start socializing. Yeah, I think once you do something long, like like three weeks or so, that's when you kind of realize that I need to socialize with somebody, and then you yeah. kind of just yeah, it depends on the person. Though. Yeah, when you get over that hump of you actually talking to people, and you're like, oh, okay, now I can do this. That happened to me in Copenhagen. I went out to this board game cafe. Oh, I fucking love board games. I was like, oh, this is sick. I like grab a coffee, but everyone's talking uh, Danish. I'm like, uh, and I'm, like, shaking, I, like, eat a cookie. I have my coffee. And I'm like, no, Jordan, like, you know, just go talk to somebody. Yeah. So the first group I went to, I talked to them. They were super friendly. They were awesome. Mm -hmm. I was like, oh, it's not so hard. It's not. Just gotta say hello. Yeah. Be nice. Smile. How are you? Mm -hmm. And that's it. And it always works. You know, you go to the bar and you see somebody that's just like, you know, having a drink and then you just kind of go up to them and if they give you an answer to a question that's longer than you know, they answer in more than one word, yeah. then they want to actually have a conversation. And yeah, just, okay. Okay. Next thing you know, you're going on a canal tour in Amsterdam on mushrooms. <laughs> it's like, okay, why not? <laughs> Yeah, so I'm Jordan Tomasoni, that is Italian, I know you won't be able to spell it, but uh, I just want to say like, I make travel videos and like this, isn't, this isn't really about me, this is about Canada and about people traveling literally the world and having to be able to meet together like this is amazing. So I'm glad that you're all here and hope I can inspire you to travel and be friendly and meet other people all over the world. Thank you Jordan, happy Canada Day. Happy 150. Thank you, happy Canada Day. Do you live here? No, I'm just on vacation. <laughs> he was on vacation and he yeah. found out about this party. That's amazing. All right, thank you, Jordan.